If you ever want to be as old and as happy as me, you better get engaged with the climate change issue, otherwise it ain't going to happen. There's, there's three issues. One is what the industry itself can do to make itself, as it were, greener. And I think quite a lot has been achieved. I mean, certainly the purpose is there, and there's been a lot of leadership from, from BAFTA, from across the board. So I think there, I'd give that a real tick. Uh, the other thing that's helpful is that the world of documentaries become much more commercial. As I say, documentaries are now being distributed better. They're available on YouTube. So actually, if you make an effective documentary, a lot more eyeballs see it than would have been true even five years ago. So I think documentaries keep coming with an effective documentary. So there are some very good ones, very, very good ones actually, on YouTube now. And in my own case, uh, I'm trying to create a drama. I mean, I'm trying to create a film which is a kind of living, breathing movie where you will deal with a couple of kids who come in as skeptics and will go out wanting to know what they can do and what, what, what streets to march on. But you can only do that really by taking a kind of narrative arc and taking people through the experience getting them to understand, not in a polemical or heavy-handed way, but actually this is huge. Uh, so, yeah, uh, and I'm sure I'm not the only one. A deep Water Horizon's just been made. That will, that will help. There'll be a, I think you'd, I hope there's not a glut of films, uh, because I'll get swamped. But I think there's going to be three or four movies that will be made that will raise the tempo. Is it a bit late for Bar Paris? Yeah, I mean, I certainly am aware that my movie will be way too late for Paris, but just going to hope that Paris is part of the process.